they were looking for solutions, they were developing, they were going to be, they wanted just to be faster. I really liked the old race cars, the noise, the way the men drove in those cars. I had my inspiration for Dutchy for, let's say, the old IndyCar race cars. I really like them. Long nose, short tail. I like it very much. But I didn't want to make a replica because it had to be mine. Franz found a 1930s Nash 88 car online and shipped it to the Netherlands from North Carolina. It then took four years to transform it into a personal tribute to the golden age of speed. Franz called the car Dutchy after his own Dutch heritage and borrowed its mascot image from a car he saw in a junkyard. The chassis is original. It's a Nash 1930. The engine, the gearbox and the drivetrain is all original. That's the basic. But the body itself, the design, I made it myself. I started with mounting a chair on the chassis exactly on the place where I wanted to be. And then I made a sort of a bird cage. I put blankets on it to see if the balance was okay. Together with uh, a metal artist, it's not a metal worker, it was a metal artist. And give him a piece of metal and he's working on it and it's awesome. A serious amount of attention to detail has gone into making this metal monster an absolute masterpiece. You can see the form of it. It's, it's inspired by the guys in the Middle Ages, the night helmet. Easy because of losing them every time. I lift it and I can fix whatever I want. The paint work, I did it all myself. I just bought lots of paint. I just put it on and some scorching paper or some water on it or some rust on it. It should look as if it has been in a barn for 70 years. So I made an exhaust pipe that comes out on a different way, on a different place in the car. The wheels, they used to be smaller, 18 inch, but the dimension was not okay. You can see on the outside, do we need some oil? Or are we taking some risks? Create the thinking of those guys. Spark plugs, so there's 16 spark plugs. It's from aviation technology. So they were prepared that Dutchie might be flying. First, the power switch. Second one is power on the ignition. The third one is the petrol. <laughs> <laughs> I do have something over here. I have to wind it up. As you might imagine, taking Dutchie out on the road, that's not for the faint-hearted. I use the car when I'm in a good mood. And that's quite often. And you have the idea you're going really fast, eating a lot of insects. So it's all together the fun of driving it on the road. And wherever he drives, people are loving this ride. Most people smile. They ask, what's that? And they are surprised that I built it myself. He said, wow, it's impressive. And people like it. And I like it.